Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Watch Dem Sheriff candidate caught on tape agreeing to kill legal gun owners. A Democrat candidate for sheriff in Buncombe County, North Carolina, says that he has no problem killing legal gun owners to confiscate their weapons if the situation arises, according to video posted to social media. If similar video on our Daryl Fisher's Facebook page is labeled accurately, the candidate's remarks came at a monthly meeting of gun control group and every town for gun safety subsidiary Moms Demand Action on March 7. The video, which was posted by the Red Elephants on Twitter, shows Fisher going through a veritable checklist of things he supports, which are the typical gun grabber items. You may not be surprised that, for instance, he wants to raise the minimum age to purchase a firearm to 21. Or that he thinks that high capacity magazines are also a bad thing and need to go. Bump stocks? Going, too. None of this was a surprise. What was, however, was his proposal on how to deal with legal firearm owners who didn't want to surrender their weapons. You've heard people say, you'll have to pry my gun from my cold, dead hands, Fisher said, and then gave a shrug. Okay, he said to laughter. Twit reads, suggests killing people to take their guns. Daryl Fisher candidate for sheriff in Buncombe County. In most of North Carolina, Fisher would generally seem to be a poor candidate with that kind of attitude. However, Buncombe County includes the ultra-liberal enclave of Asheville, a sort of San Francisco for the Tar Heel State. In fact, Fisher has served as a captain with the Asheville Police Department and is currently the county's law enforcement training director. And doesn't that just make you feel safe? There's not a whole lot of polling out there, but those factors could mean he's got a legitimate shot. That probably ought to frighten you, considering there hasn't been a worse candidate for sheriff that I can remember since Hunter S. Thompson, and at least Thompson believed in the Second Amendment, if just because he liked shooting at things in his backyard while he was outrageously intoxicated. Thompson's candidacy was also kind of a joke. This guy appears to be dead serious and stone sober. While the video is edited, I can't think of any way in which this comment was taken out of context. The fact that this guy was able to talk about being willing to kill people over the Second Amendment is a horrible omen. The fact that Mom's Demand Action members thought it was funny was worse. This guy cannot become a sheriff. Buncombe County residents need to mobilize, and they need to mobilize now. The alternative is simply too grim to imagine. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click, like, and subscribe. Thank you.